Well, I just went over and looked at the bay. It looks uh, better than it did yesterday, but nothing In great. In a quarter mile, turn left onto Bayville Road. So I'm going to the land of Nada. The gig master just stopped by and brought me my glasses back. Said he was going to Nandanata, so I told him I'd meet him down there. And I talked to the Mumbles man. He's working on one of his generators getting ready for the storm. He couldn't go. So I'll give you a report when I get to Nada. We'll see what it looks like. Now, if it's no targets there at all, I'm only going to spend uh, 45 minutes or less. I'm coming back here to see if it's got any better Turn this afternoon. Road. I'll get back to you. One thing about bad about going to Nada, if we get any kind of lightning, they close the damn beach on us. Not that like that we can close it automatically anyway for, for me. If, if I was on the bay, I would have to quit. But sometimes they shut the beach down, you know, and they won't let us on there. I don't know if I told you this or not, but I'm headed to pick up some knives right now. As a matter of fact, the guy's calling me right now. Stand by. Picked up the knives. Some kitchen knives. I had done before, but it was about a year ago. And then he gave me two little processor blades. And then he gave me a really fancy cigar cutter. I'll show you a picture of it later. I know y'all not in the knives, so uh, I don't bore you too much. Look at that cloud right there. God! Stand by. I like to roll the sidewalks up. Lots of parking places. Not many depositors. There's always a few. Actually, there's more than I was expecting to see down here. Got monster waves, which I knew we would have, preceding the storm. That's moving some stuff, I hope. That's the plan. We see how it goes. Hello. Stand by. I like it already. Beach is nice and wide, it looks like. Nice wide beach. I maybe don't like wide, but I like it. I don't see the gig, Meister. He's got a bright yellow shirt on. You can't miss him when you get close to it. Stand by. in and out until I find a corn line, if I find one. Then I'm going to work up and down that corn line. Well, first coin says it's a penny. I should say first sound says it's a penny. 36. I hate deep pennies. You know you ain't gonna get nothing. Come out of there, you turkey. Stand by, let me get that sucker out of there. Think about the CTA, it's too deep. That's six damn scoops for one penny. At least it says there's a penny. Find that damn thing. Get it out of there. Yep, one bigger penny. I told you. God. Unbelievable. I hate them. But it could be a big old gold ring with a lot of copper in it. And you gotta dig them damn pennies whether you want to or not. Alright, let's work up and down this little road right here for a few feet. 
if there's anything else lingering in this little zone right here. Let me make this thing a little longer. We'll grab it back here a little bit. Just make a wide sweep. Like eight foot, ten foot wide. Okay. We dug three pennies and a dime. Now we've got a 1207. We moved up about five feet up the beach. I see it. I don't like it. Part of somebody's sunglasses. 1207. Maybe the rest of them's in the hole. That's a good sign. A nice green dime. I like that. An 02 here, 1202. Since we got it out, it might be little, so I'm going to carry it up here. Hope we saved it. Yep, 1203 out of the hole. No knockout gold ring, no knockout gold chain. I don't see a damn thing. What I thought was it was not it, but we do have it. It's like it was an earring or a grommet. Oh, a piece of crap. Three blocks. Maybe four blocks ahead of me. I think I see it. I'm pretty sure it's in. First street. Now I'm going to grid up and down in here kind of tight for at least a block. Let the gig catch up. Twelve, twelve. I have seen the time I like 1212. I see it now, it looks like another grommet. Or it could be a little ring, I can't tell which. Let's try neither. Let's try buckle off a pair of Levi's or something like that. Ha! That'll probably be rusty before I get home. I don't know, it's got a mark right now though. Maybe it won't be. But I suspect it will be. Faster. <laughs> yes, I got a lot of pennies already. And a lot of dimes. One earring. Huh? One earring. One earring. I got a piece of gold, I think. Gold. Let's see that gold. gold. It's, it might not, it's so small, it probably won't register on the scale, but I got a piece. One cent. One cent. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's gold, but it ain't, it ain't a race to the scale. I got gold, but it ain't, I don't think it'll be rusty the time I get home. Yeah. But it hasn't got a mark right there on it. That's the first thing. That's not the gold one. Okay. That's got ice on it. It's got ice on it. I'll see you marking it. I don't think you got to worry about that. Thing here that I think is gold here. Oh yeah, yeah, I guarantee that's gold. Somebody lost a little doodad off the thing. Yeah, that's gold there, I believe. I think it's a necklace. Yeah, I do too. I mean, it was on a necklace. Did you see anything in it? Anymore. Since I got my glasses back, I might be able to see. There's something right there, but it's so small I can't make it out. At least I think it is. Yeah, I think that thing has to be real. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it is. 
It's a little girl's face, is it? I thought it was Jesus. It might be Jesus. It's a face of some sort. Damn, I dropped this in the wrong pouch. But that'll work. That's what we're looking for. Yellow metal. So I got a mark right there, but I can't make it out. Well, 14. A lot of penny. I got a lot of pennies today. Yep, it is five cents though. Just what it's supposed to be. Five cents. It's the Neptune. I'm not going any further this way. I'm going to go south. South, I say. Holy jumping Toledo. Another 12, 13. I see it right on top of that pile right there. I'm going to have to dig it up. See it right there? Green nickel. What is that? Five cents. Huh? Five cents. You want it? You gotta clean it off. It's got green stuff on it. It's a five cent piece. Twelve fifteen. Come on, shiny gold ticket. Where are you? I'm looking for you hard today. gig off in the distance. See what how he's making out. Uh oh. Twelve thirteen. About three blocks back, so there's plenty in here if you want to dig some more. Oh my god, pennies everywhere! I'm just digging dimes and quarters. I hear you, man. Nothing else. Woo. Yeah. I still got that one earring, that's all I got. I ain't getting nothing else either. One little gold won't erase it, right? Leo. A million dimes and a million 
quarters. This is 12 14. I don't have any nickels. Maybe three or two. 12 14. Come out of there, Tequito. I just dug a dime eight scoop deep. This is what, five right here? Come out of there. sign sometimes. I mean, it's right on top. The next hole, I mean, scoop out. Yeah, there it is, right there. Let's see what it is. 12, 14. Somewhere still right there. Right in the edge. You got it. Look at this. Just what it's supposed to be. Five cents. Hey. I'm going to ask you what you keep finding that's surprising, I guess. Mostly dimes and Fourteen quarters, twenty-one dimes, five nickels, and I stopped digging pennies. Leo. Okay, I think the gig master found a 10k uh, gold uh, wrist chain. You know, one of them. I look like an ID bracelet. He sent me a picture of it a minute ago, but he hadn't gotten home, so he couldn't see inside that little pendant to see what the pendant was. But you can check his video out. He'll probably have it on there. I mean, I know he will. Okay. I might be hurricane stuff in the morning, but I'm probably not going to go. I got a few knives. Well, stand by, get them knives and show them to you.